instead of creating a volatile table and then populating it with an insert select, here's four very clever examples where you can do it all in one shot. I call this a CTOS, create table as. Let's look at the first example with the red arrow. Create volatile table, I give it a name, as select everything from order table. So it's going to pull all of the information from the order table. It won't bring over the exact same data definition or DDL because I've got the parens and the select asterisk. I say I want the data to come. I'm giving it a primary index and on commit preserve rows keeps those in there the entire session. Now let's look at the next example in blue. Notice here I create a multi-set volatile table. I can either have a set or a multi-set. And then I call it its name and I say as, select everything from that order table again with data and statistics. It will copy the statistics from the order table and bring that to the volatile table. Of course, I gave it a primary index because I'm really smart. And then I say on commit preserve rows, stick around the entire session. Let's look at the next example. I'm going to create the volatile table, give it a name as select everything from the order table with data and statistics again. And that's a great way to get the data with those statistics. But here I didn't say if it was a set or multi-set, it's going to default to whatever the DBA set the system at originally. And then lastly, take a look at this. I can actually put a WHERE clause in and not bring all of the columns or all of the data. And that's the choices that I can make. I create the volatile table, I give it a name, and as select everything from the order table WHERE, extract the month from the order date equals 9. I only want September orders. And with data and statistics. Now those statistics since I'm not bringing all of that data with me, they'll be called zeroed statistics. When I then say collect statistics on my volatile table, it'll actually run through, look at all the data, collect statistics on the same columns of the original table in a very clever four ways of doing things. This lesson is brought to you by Coughing Data Warehousing. Begin your Teradata journey the right way with our Teradata Basics book. Visit coughingdw.com for more information. Hi, this is Tom Coughing. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please hit subscribe to make sure you are kept up to date on all our videos.